Hey guys, I'm um, just coming back with my Dollar Tree haul. I bought this a while ago, but it's been sitting here, so I just wanted to show you guys. Um, I don't know if I found anything spectacular. I found a couple things that, you know, might interest you guys. I'm not sure, but, um, you know, I just thought I would show you guys. Um, I've been into buying, not really too many, but some cute little puzzles lately. Um, I haven't really had the time to put any together yeah, like I told you guys, I've been trying to clean the house. I don't get rid of things, but then I go buy new things. But I'm trying to be selective what I buy. Um, I figure in the winter time, you know, besides crafting and stuff, just to have a puzzle on the table, just sometimes to sit down and, you know, work on that. Because uh, some of our residents work on puzzles. Sometimes it's nice if I get a minute just to sit down with them and, um, you know, chit chat and, you know, whatever when I have time in between. Um, so, you know, um, I found this cute one. Like I said, a hundred times, you guys know I like the old vintage kind of, you know, and retro and the, uh, well, this is a lot more than retro, but, but, um, period drama pieces and stuff like that. So I kind of, I found this one I kind of liked, um, I got that one and then anything kind of, um, uh, to do with books or, um, crafting or whatever. Um, so I found this one here, um, um, this is yarns and I love all the colors. So I found that one. Um, I found, I think there's another one in my other bag. I'll show you guys. And I found a peacock one. I sent that in front of mail to Virginia, uh, V Connor 7-Eleven. And I sent her one of these frames. I decoupaged it and stuff. I hope she likes it. It's like, you know, I'm still new at, new at crafting. I, you know, I buy a lot of craft stuff and I putter or whatever, but you know, um, I think a lot of us aren't exactly like, you know, expert crafters but we enjoy it so you know we and none of us ever even expert crafters probably don't think that it works perfect but you know we try and you know we hope someone likes what we make but anyways i found these frames um you know like a lot of dollar stores are trying to get more um crafty stuff and i found these wooden frames so i thought these was, would be cool to decoupage on um and stuff so i got i think i got three of each i got three of these ones they only had the two designs I got three of those and then this is the one I did for Virginia with the heart um so I got three of these I love the little baby's feet it's cute and then I got I did get one calendar I was waiting because they've had these counters out since I think like um June or something July you know it's like okay usually they would wait at least until September or, you know or a little bit later so, because I hate when I get a counter and, you know, if you can buy them too early and then they get all squished or you put them away and then they, you know, so I'm like, I'm trying to limit myself. Like I would find all these cute counters and then I would go buy one. I always like to have one for work. You know, I put it in my pocket because if, you know, working my shift, sometimes I have to call and make an appointment later in the day or something like that. So I always like to have a little, like the plastic kind, you know, that way they can bend in my pocket or something like that. But then I end up buying like a hard hardback one that I never use, you know, so it's a waste of money. Even a dollar adds up. So I'm trying to, you know, avoid that stuff. You know, like I said, I'm trying to save my money and trying to, you know, and then I would find like a dozen counters, you know, like, oh, I have to have that one. I have to have this one, you know, but I'm like, I'm trying not to do that. I just bought this one counter because I just put one on the fridge. I don't hang one in here anymore. I don't hang one wherever. So I'm just, I just got one for the fridge. So I saw this cute this pretty one I'm like oh that's really pretty that would brighten up the fridge you know when I look at it or whatever um so it's just got all these pretty flowers on it all these different I think it's yes you know, all different flowers but a lot of more roses so I found that one so that's just going to be the one I use on the fridge um I don't really write on the one on the fridge appointments or anything it's just pretty much I write like my garbage comes every when uh, every other Wednesday or something so like I'll circle that you know stuff like that and if I need to look up a quick date or something, oh, I can put that back in the bag for now. Um, so yeah, but I always have to have, I always like to have on the fridge. I feel so discombobulated today. But this rain and stuff, discombobulating um here's a couple other puzzles i got um this one i thought was pretty with the merry-go-round um and just a whole like um these are actually they say round 
so they're like round puzzles the whole little fair and then I got this one here um, the kind of Victorian you guys got these last year um, the little tin words um, I didn't get any I don't know if our store got any or if they just sold out before you guys showed them and I um, you know God or whatever um, they have thankful harvest and welcome I was gonna get more than one but then I'm like am I really gonna use more than one because really I just kind of wanted the welcome that way if I did a welcome read for something like that uh, I don't know when I'm gonna use them or whatever but I just bought one Whoop. So just to have, you know, the welcome. Um, I got just one of these. They had the pumpkin and stuff, but this I can use anytime. Um, I just kind of liked the house. You guys know I love miniature houses. Um, I could actually, if I wanted to do like a little, even if I just wanted to cut pictures out of magazines to make it look like you're looking in or something. So I just bought one of those just to experiment with. Um, I bought one of these. I did all the windows last year, and in the summertime I didn't even... I do the windows except for one um, where I put the air conditioner in. I actually bought another one, one of these from the dollar store. Um, I actually had the duck brand, which is like the national brand. Um, so I don't know how well these are going to work. This is the door insulation kit um, from the dollar store because I want to redo that window. <clears throat> so we'll see. I'll let you guys know how that works. We'll see. I'll put that over there so I can use it later. I did pick up a napkin. Or two napkins. I thought this was pretty. With the fall leaves. And I got one for summer. Which I thought. And I got this too. Um, which I thought was kind of cool. Even if you just decorate it. Like put some holly on it or something to decorate it for you know, Christmas time. But it's just a little, one of those little candle snuffers. They also had it in gold and silver. But I kind of like the old black kind of um, antique look. Um, I got this friend book, Friends, you know, it's got like poems and stuff. I meant to send this to Virginia too, but I forgot. So in our, you know, next friend mail, um, you know, I'll do that. So, um, and then I picked up cause I've been lazy, not making cards cause all my stuff is just so, you know, in boxes and stuff. So I picked up some, um, Thanksgiving. Um, I picked up two of these tags with the string. I don't know if I use the string or not, maybe in certain projects, but they had these 30 tags. And I've seen a lot of people on um, tickets and stuff, you know, doing the little stamps and stuff. And I thought these would be cute, even just to color them or tea dye, you know, maybe do something different you know, like tea dye them and then stamp on them or just something, you know, we'll see. So I picked up two of those because um, they don't have these very often. Sometimes I'll get them for in the summertime for tag sales or yard sales. Um, so I picked up two of those. Um, I also found this there, which i never seen. It's a sales order book. I was like, oh, that'd be kind of cool to tea dye because I see a lot of you guys will, you know, sell these in your sales too and stuff like that, you know, or different receipts and stuff like that. So I thought that was kind of cool, so I picked that up. I only saw this one. I've never seen that before, but it's by Jot, so they must get more of them. Um, and then they had this there, which I thought, they had three of them. I was going to buy three, and then I was like, no, just save your money. You only need one for yourself, because I only know one person that has this, and you have to have a certain size. And um, it's called the Skinny Mini. It's an iPad mini holder. It's the Spring Fling collection by from studio c i don't know if studio c is like a if it's a name brand i think it is it doesn't say anything but yeah it's this ipad cover yeah it's kind of girly but i'm like you know it's like i don't really take it to work or anything um but yeah this is from the dollar store let me get my it says it holds an eight it's an eight inch and Eight and a quarter by five and three eight or uh, three quarters. So let's see in case you guys find these and you want one, then to know if it's gonna fit yours. Because I just bought a Amazon. I think I told you guys.
yes, I'm in my jammies and my shirt that's three times too big, but I bought, you know, my favorite color. Oh, look at that. <laughs> you guys know my favorite color is yellow, but I just bought the Amazon. Um, I bought, let's see if it fits in here because this is supposed to be eight inch. Actually, nope, it doesn't fit. Well, that's weird. It will not fit that. It's, this is too big because this says it's an 8 inch, but I guess it's bigger than this. So maybe this will go in friend mail if any of you guys have a... Huh. Because there's no other way to fit it in there, and that's weird. Yeah, there's no, you know, you can't, huh, that is weird. So I guess I'll put that maybe in front mail if somebody has, you know, that, if any of you guys have a, um, it's a beautiful case and it's, you know, it says it's supposed to fit an 8.25 and this is supposed to be an 8 inch. Let me measure it. Yeah, this says eight and a quarter, so I'm not really sure why it doesn't fit, but okay. Maybe that's why I went to the dollar store. Maybe those were made a little bit shorter. But anywho, yeah, we got these napkins, which I think are really pretty. I don't know what I'm going to do with them yet, but I love, you know, guys know I love this. We, like most of us, we love the country chicken kind of theme. Um, so, I don't know, something this summer, I don't know yet, just kind of that picnic, kind of, what I'm going to do with them yet, we'll see. Um, but I bought two of these, of course, you guys know I love, these light up, and they actually write really well. Um, so I bought, I limited myself, I only got two of these, one of each color, which you guys know I love anything with the Christmas bulbs, any kind of, anything at all. I just love Christmas, you know, the bulbs, they just bring joy, <laughs> you know. Um, so I've limited myself to two of those. Um, I bought, uh, I think, five more of these because I want to put these on my tree. These are really cool. Um, I won't open these, but I bought three more last time. I don't know if I showed you. I, I don't know if I did a video with these. Um, but these really do light up, and they're beautiful. They're the light up icicles. And they actually give you all the batteries. The batteries are probably worth more than that. So, yeah, I got five more of those. I saw a tree, I think it's from one of my catalogs um, that I went online and was looking at. They did it like a country tree with like all burlap kind of um, ornaments and stuff like that. And that's kind of what I want to go for this year. Um, so I went back and I got three more of the doors. I'm going to, I can't, I can't afford to buy, of course, you know, all the ornaments that, you know, they did on there. So I'm kind of trying to buy um i'm trying to buy like ornaments like this that are country themed um you know kind of things like this burlap and you know like these this is kind of country to me so i'm trying to buy like things like this that i can kind of do a country theme with then with like we're ribbon um you know ribbon swags or whatever you know so we'll see and then i think the last thing yeah, the last thing I got was this. They had a pumpkin one, too, I was going to buy. I think it was a pumpkin one. But the last thing I got, which I need to hang up if I'm, you know, before Halloween. Oh, actually, Halloween's in a few days. But anyways, I would probably hang this up all the time anyways because I like the little shoes and stuff, you know. Um, happy Halloween. I loved, I loved the little shoes. So I hadn't seen this before. So it's like, it's funny. The things are still putting out, you know, because they're, they've been so backed up in my Dollar Tree. So, yeah, that's all the stuff I got. I hope you guys like it. Um, if you like this video, give a thumbs up, leave a comment below, and ring that bell.